Oh, my goodness. Yeah. That's two. Confirmed. Up, oh, and she gets another turn. She's looking for the fall. Step over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No hands yet. There's one. There's and two. And that is a fall. 16 pounds, and we've got another Shriner versus Eureka matchup. Shriner out to an early lead. It's Jaya Ashley taking on Kylie Bear. Take down. That's a turn. Nice, nice shot. This is it to a throw. That's four. And another champion for Schreiner University. Three of the first four. Burn of that bar arm. Now she's stepping over. Oh, man. There it is. And there's the fall. That essentially, I, if not mathematically, that might psychologically have wrapped things up True. for Schreiner. Sorry, we like to hype ourselves up and, um, you know, compete at our best. We really try to think about how we can be better and do our best and not really think about who it is that we're wrestling, but just how we can prove that we really work hard in our mat room. Um, with that same thing, we feel the same way about like uh, meeting new schools and new wrestlers because we are kind of far away regional-wise or even just conference. Um, and so it's always kind of scary, but also a little exciting to see these new wrestlers. But we try to stay really confident in what we learn in the mat room and what our coaches teach us and what we work on every single day. So we're always very confident in our technique and what we work, but it's always fun to see new wrestlers and get these new looks. So we were keeping track of the team points the whole entire time. And even going into this uh, tournament, we knew our toughest opponent was gonna, was gonna be Eureka. Um, they brought in 11, we brought in 10. So it, we knew it was gonna be tough. And at the same time, the girls have been getting better and better as each performance been going by in this tournament. Um, but it, it was a big privilege. Um, the girls really came together. They had a lot of nerves. I'm like, guys, it's just a conference tournament. You've been doing, you were at Tornado, you were at NCC. Like, it's okay. Just keep doing what you're doing. Be hard to score on. Win the positions. Let's have fun. And so we had good energy going in. They really supported each other and growing pains, I can say. So it just prepped us for regionals this coming weekend. Um, my season as a whole, it was it was very eventful. Uh, I had to stop wrestling for a little bit at the beginning because of a knee injury. Uh, but I went on break. I, I did what I had to do to come back. And luckily, my team was by my side when I came back, and they, they helped me get as good as I can and prep me for just throwing me out there, actually, my first matches. Uh, but I, I really do appreciate the support I got from them and, and all that. Uh, it just makes me feel real special the, to be able to come out here and compete, do what I want to do, do what I love, uh, and have fun doing it, you know. And going into regionals, I'm, I'm very excited. Uh, it's a very exciting territory. It's something new. I've never been there. It's uh, my freshman year, so I hope I can do good, as good as I did here, uh, show off what I've been working on in the mat room with my team, and just all that. I really hope it's a good turnout for all of us. Two takedown. For Mata. And there's one turn. She's looking to go the other way. It is 4 nothing. Going high gut. Now she's going across. And we'll stand back up 4-0 in favor of Mata. 